But right now, let's stop the time with her. That was insane. <laughs> What's up, everyone? How are you guys doing? I hope everyone is doing well. I hope everyone is staying safe. You know, right now here in Europe, it's taking a bad turn again, you know, when it comes to the COVID situation. So everyone, please be more cautious now. Stay safe, you know, it's gonna be a hot winter, I guess. But once we get over this winter, hopefully everything will be slowly getting back to normal. So speaking about getting to normal, I don't think I'm gonna be back to normal after reacting to the last video I made, Pentatonix with Hallelujah. That was amazing. Please make sure to check that one out. And I think we're gonna react to another amazing performer because right now we're gonna do something completely new. I have never heard a Turkish song in my whole life. Well, 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 let's take it back. Of course, when I grew up, there was this one song, this one song in particular that was so famous. Of course, I'm talking about this song. So this was a song request by one of my good friends, actually. What's up, Serhat? He told me to react to you. Turkish music. So here we go. We're talking about the beautiful, actually, and still very young looking Sertap Erenar. She's a Turkish singer, songwriter and composer and is actually a soprano. So let's do this. The song is called Ask and it will be the acoustic version. Now, I don't even know the original version, but acoustic sounds pretty cool. So let's dive right in. Please make sure to subscribe. Also make sure to hit that little bell button next to it. That way you don't miss out. Once I upload new music and new Turkish songs. So let's do this. I hope you guys will enjoy this one. Here we go. I have no idea what to expect. But this is the reason why we're actually doing this. Let's go. All right, here we go. Let's turn it up a bit. Alright, so it's the Turkish word Ashk. I thought it's ask in English. By the way, I'm a huge fan of acoustic performances. I used to love the MTV Unplugged series. <laughs> uh, here we go again. This is gonna be another artist. I can see already now everyone texting me wanting more songs. And of course, we will definitely react to more because if you're an artist like that, you deserve every bit of exposure. Let's rewind it, man. I didn't see that coming. You know, and I have seen a lot of crazy performers such as Dimash, Huai Chen Yu, but this was right now something I was never, never expecting. So that really caught me by surprise because she actually kept singing at the beginning and then she transformed it without taking a pause. Wow, what a control. Yeah, you can tell she's been doing this for a long time, man. To be able to control her voice like that is not easy at all. Here we go, that's exactly what I mean. That's exactly what I mean right now, man. That's really uncommon, or at least, you know, the music that I know of when you actually hold a note, normally you, you do maybe ooh, pause ah, and then you go higher or whatever and then you change your note, but she's actually transforming into ah. I know it sounds awful, but that's the best way to explain it. And that's something right now that really sucks out. Amazing, really cool. And it's just good to see musicians doing a live acoustic performance. So intimate, so awesome. Let's continue. Yeah. Again.
And by the way, look at the way she's actually taking or turning her head once she goes for that powerful note because she knows exactly about the microphone and if she is just too close while performing that powerful note that it will actually sound bad on the recording. So again, she's a professional through and through. You can tell right now she's been doing that for a long time. But look right now, pay attention to her head when she goes for that note. Here we go. There we go. There you go. Yep. Nice, man. That violin solo. I think that's my first time seeing somebody playing the violin since uh, the guys. What's the name again? I forgot. What? Uh oh, 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 oh. I think this might be something for my vocal timer. I did it once almost a half year ago with Tool and that was insane. But right now, let's stop the time with her. That was insane. Where was that? Man, what an ending. That was insane. Unbelievable. All right, guys, that was it. What a shocking and insane, man. Sertab Erenar with Ashk. The acoustic live version. That was insane, you know. Especially the beginning when she started out singing and she came up with that note and then she came up with that transformation, you know, every time she sang. I was blown away, so I could tell right at the beginning, uh oh, we're gonna see something amazing, it's gonna be very, very crazy, and I was right. Thank you guys for watching, man. Thank you, Serhat, for recommending me this music video, actually her in general, because I think we're gonna see a lot more from her. That was amazing. So I think the next song should maybe be something else, maybe not an acoustic version, maybe something, I don't know, a live performance on a real stage. Let me know what songs I should react to next by Sertab Erina. And right now, I don't know who hold the note longer, if it was Maynard or her, but this might be a competition now. Unbelievable. All right, guys, take care. Bye-bye. Stay safe, of course. See you next time.